What's up guys? In this video I'm gonna show you how to fix, extend volume, or shrink volume grayed out issue in Windows Disk Management. As you can witness, this C drive is full. And we got some extra free space left in the D drive. In a short while, I'll show you how to extend the C drive without losing data. Let's start with three golden rules, in other words, the limitations of default Windows Disk Management Utility. Rule number one. Unallocated or free space should be available immediately after the drive that you would like to extend. Let's look at couple of cases. Right click on start and go to disk management. Over here we have unallocated space, immediately after the drive that we would like to extend. So we have no issues with extend volume option. In few simple clicks, we can resize the C drive. But let's look at the other cases. Here we do not have unallocated space anywhere in this particular disk. Or we have unallocated space that's not immediately after the drive that we want to extend. And that's exactly the reason the extend volume is completely grayed out in both these cases. Rule number two. Windows built-in disk management only allows resizing NTFS and raw partitions. Look at this PC, we have free space left in the D drive. In spite of that, the shrink volume option is grayed out. That's because the D drive in this PC is a FAT32 file system. Rule number 3. We cannot extend the volume in primary partition with the free space available in the extended partition. Generally, within Windows Disk Management Utility, anything that you see in blue is part of primary partition and green is part of extended partition. So basically, you cannot transfer space between blue and green. Luckily, there are a lot of third-party free utilities available in the market, and these utilities have no such limitations. And they are very easy to use. I'm gonna use Minitool Partition Wizard. Please carefully download the free edition, and not these demo ones. Also, during the installation process, you can probably uncheck these boxes. Please follow the on-screen instructions and complete the installation. Once installed, open the utility. Right-click on the drive that you want to extend. The Extend option is now available. Please click on it. Over here you can choose from which drive you want to take free space from. And this slider gives you control over how much free space do you want to take. Please select OK. Let's go ahead and apply these changes. We're all done, so please close the mini tool partition wizard. Excellent, I got my C drive resized successfully. I hope it works for you as well. Thank you so much for watching.